Um, okay. How do I... I'm gonna go here and I'm gonna check something. We're gonna go... Is it probably character... Oh, that was you, Sobriety. Let's go. Uh, add me as a friend, man. Add me as a friend. Uh, I think I can just actually... Uh, there you go. Um, Alright. Uh, chat, how do I change it so I can change the color of um, my teammates' name colors? That makes sense. So... Uh, name settings, others, um, see, it's something like this, but I want to change the color. We're getting there. Is it PVP? No. Ah! Yes. Uh, I think yellow? I'll just make it... No. We'll make it... I want to see pink is probably the play. Yeah. Because nothing says DPS like a pink. <laughs> um... Alright, and what else do I want to do? I want it to go here. I want it to go... Uh, key binds and hot bar. So we've got one, two, three, four, five. What the hell did I just do? Oh shit! I don't know what I'm fighting, but I'm just spamming one. Alright, I just killed something. Alright. One, two, three, four, five. And then we're gonna do Q. I don't care about strafing. E. Uh, R? Auto run. Uh, that's fine. I've got that bound to my mouse. And F. Q E R F. I think that's the play. Could do a Z in there. Maybe a Q E R F. C or Z? Probably Z. I probably prefer Z. Trying to get better at pressing Z. What does shift do in this game? Uh, that that'll be fine. Nine will be fine for now. And then this, I want it all shift. Why is it doing control? Oh, whoops. Uh, shift Q, Shift E, Shift R, Shift F. Why is it? Set focus target? I don't know what that does. I have three hotbars for skills. One with control, one with shift. And then Q, E, R, F, G, H, T. FG, how the hell do you reach H? What the hell's wrong with you? What are you, what, what, what have you got? Freaking claws? Who the hell uses H? What kind of monster? Actually, wait a minute. It kind of, you kind of push the thumb down and wait a minute. That kind of works. <laughs> so it seems like you're like me. You hate the left side. I'm really bad with my left pinky and left uh, ring finger, I guess is the word. I'm trying to get better with him, so... I only recently have started using Z and X. Uh, I was a... Uh, what's it called, kid? Console kid growing up. The current, the PC I'm currently using is my first ever PC, so... Um, alright. So for... Wait, did I not save it? Oh, did I not save the keybinds? No... Did I not save it? No, I did. Oh, I did key setting two. Whoops. Uh, 
Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, I done shift Q. I 100% agree. Shift Q and shift D. Um, I Q and E are like my favorite buttons. Um, all right. And I like my movement buttons on Q. So my movement thing is going to be repelling shot. Uh, do I use repelling shot a lot? Not really. Um, leg graze. Something tells me. Am I ever going to use this chat? I mean, I can, I can. Q and E. I like that. I'm just going to spam. I, I'm just going to click. I'm not going to lie. I'm just going to click this while I'm like running around. Um, so that's leg graze and that's foot graze, which we're just never going to use. Um, so Q and yeah, five can be our... Man, I'm weird. I don't like five. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. Okay, I like that. I like that. Um, I genuinely might just get this off. I might get rid of these. I know Frozen. I'm just not good with mouse and keyboard. I really am not. We're learning. I still, I still truly think I'm learning. <clears throat> like, I kid you not, bro. I just recently realized how useful Z and X are. Too many skill. I'm getting rid of these. I'm sure there'll be a time we might need them, but they're just ruining it. Huey FZX. Yeah, I need to get... Oh, you use X? Oh, hell nah. Sorry, I meant Z. I don't get how anybody can use X. Do you, like, press it with your nail? Ugh. I don't get how people use X. That baffles me. My middle finger is for W and S only. I don't want it nowhere else. Press it with your index finger? Oh, oh. Nah, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I press it with my thumb? What is wrong with you guys? Okay, maybe thumb, I guess. What is wrong with you all? No, I'm not going to lie. You guys are the PC kids. Uh, I wasn't a PC kid. <laughs> I really want to get to a mount today, but that might that might be a while. Oh, look, they're flaming the healer. I remember this. <laughs> so who's Avir, by the way? Did we meet him? Poor healer always gets the blame. Too right. Should have should have healed everyone. That's why I'll never play a healer. It's too much pressure. <sighs> Get rid of the bear's head. Bury it. Cremate it. Jeez. Stop carrying it around. Oh. <laughs> Who is this person? Did we see them before? Okay, time to go to Ulda.
Well, what's this? Head graze. Ooh. Oh, and look where it went. The perfect button. E. Perfect for an interrupt. Absolute beautiful. Interrupts are so fun. They're always such a fun spell to have. You always feel so accomplished when you do it. Oh, you can only interrupt flashing red actions. Oh, I can't use it on the, like, the orange circle actions that they do? They're cast by with flash red. So you know when they're surrounded by like an orange thing or the orange cone? I can interrupt that, correct? We can test it on a monster, but I'm just wondering. Uh, Ulda, 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 Ulda. Ah, uh, here comes the beautiful Ulda music. Some are saying orange bar, some are saying red bar. Cast bar will flash red. Uh, a little bit confused about that, but we'll see. Do, 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 do. Stop interrupting my beautiful music. Thank you. This is literally music to study to. I'm going to be real with you guys. Whenever I see that orange, you know, AOE monster thing, I'm just going to interrupt it. Just so I get the... So I keep the... Uh, so the instinct is that... Mamodi! There's my fave. There she is. I should have made a La La Fell. It just would have been hilarious being a La La Fell archer. Oh yeah, Kentucky Fried Chicken guy. The Colonel, I remember him. Papi Liam or whatever the hell his name is. No, I don't think that's him. Oh, Papa Shan. What is it with this game and Mother and Papa and everything? What the hell's going on? How you doing, Colonel? You gonna tell me the recipe or not? I think, I think we get another dungeon right now. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, they collapsed the mines. Yeah, that's so cool. Yeah, the lore behind this dungeon is actually kind of dark, isn't it? They basically sent some slaves down there to mine, and then uh, they, like, mined into some dark shit and turned them all evil. Something like that? And so they turned on their owners? Or did I just make that all up? All right, I'll do it. Did 
They ran into an animal. <laughs> to, to One Piece fan. <laughs> Misa. Okay. Do, do. Do, 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 do. Uh, that's just a waste of money. Why is that the thing? Ah, oh, there it is. Um, I'm kind of new to the game, but I've only slowly been working through that since. Not really done any of this, so only vague recollections. Ah, it's pretty badass, isn't it? That's exactly where I want to get, by the way, Heaven's Ward. That's the goal. We are getting to Heaven's Ward. Watch and learn. Do not let me stop until we get to Heaven's Ward. I'm not and then I won't stop. I know I won't. It's just the 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 Oh man. Banaland's so cool. It's just a little bit of the drag, you know what I mean? You know, I remember like level 30-ish to 40-ish is kind of slow. That, that kind of area. I also didn't really enjoy the... the it's because I probably wasn't paying much attention, but the Scion stuff was kind of... Uh, a bit boring, so hopefully uh, when I'm paying attention more this time, we'll uh, enjoy it more. Well, I won't be paying attention more. I'll mostly just be, you know, kind of vibing like what we're doing now. Yeah, exactly what I'm doing. Yeah, try yeah, that's basically what I'm doing. I'm currently basically reading and getting general ideas of what's going on. And what's cool is I've got you guys here, so if there's anything that I definitely miss, 100% you'll all let me know. And there will be stuff I miss. So it's going to be tons of fun. It really is. Okay, I'll keep that in mind, Robin. Level 26 to 30-ish story. Yeah, okay. We're also going to be trying out other classes. Um, I think I'm going to try tanking. Because I just did a dungeon with two of you guys. So, and I can tank with NPCs. 100% I'm a pretty big lore nerd for this game. Good, good. And I think what tank class I want to try is the Marauder. No. <laughs> rogue. I think there is a rogue in this game and they turn into a ninja. Look who's here already. Wait, have you got a healing class? Oh, wait, wait, it's you. Okay. Milady. Yeah, I could, but I like I like finding out in game. Um, all right. Uh, shades, are you are you joining? How do I um? How do I find you, shades? What's the button for friends? Social, there we go. Cool. See, like, I could totally tank. If I have you guys with me, I I'd be comfortable tanking. But I don't want to do it with randoms. 
Not yet. We have to work our way up to f eventually tank with randoms. That is going to be scary, man. Well, would you look at that? Let's go. See, this is why I wanted to play it online, man. It's so good. It's, uh, on stream. It's so cool playing with you guys. If you haven't, make a character. Join us. Join, join us. Come to the dark side. Yeah, I hope so, Kelza. It's just getting the confidence, right? Okay, now that's a tank. Ah! I threw! Help! Make sure you guys keep a lookout for chests. I see you're already starting to practice pulling trash for. <laughs> So he, he just lost them? Is that right, what he's doing? Did I just hit? Oh no, I got healed for 192. I thought I hit for it. Oh my god. I pressed Q by accident. Yeah, good thing there is an invisible wall. Would have been over. Yeah, I clenched. Some what? The hell is happening? I'm gonna press it. God, I'm cool. Oh, run!
Oh shit! Cool. This guy's already more. This guy's already more challenging than the other bosses. The other dungeon bosses. Badass. Check this out. Oh shit! <laughs> I was looking that way. What the hell? Oh, I got so cocky. <laughs> Why did that happen? I was looking the other way. <sighs> so I tried looking this way and then using Q, but it still sent me that way. I have to figure out why that happened. I'm just going to greet everything. Hey, Heather. Damn, that's savage. I, I can't wait to play uh, Guild Wars 2 one day. I really need to use this more often. It's actually huge. Damage dealt by 15%. I need to use that way more often. Don't, please don't say that ever again. They're really nice, yeah, right. Boom! Flubber! Flubber? I can't remember what it's called. One of them. I wonder if he's immune to poison. Nope. Dup, da, da, da. Ah! Ah! Ah, oh, it's like me when I was a teenager. Come on, Kerr. See, when I press 1 and 4 chat, it feels like it's cancelling out my 1. Are you guys sure it's, it's damaging twice? Tressa. looking good it's not cancelling the cast it's cancelling the animation ah okay so it's like a auto cancel in league kind of auto attack cancel you press one and then it switches to the thingy animation Mean to 
do that. That thing got wrecked. Trissa. Chungus. Masters must pay, masters must die. Never again, never. I mean, they've got a point. Right? We sent them down here, now they've turned into this. The healer got wrecked. Cancel it. No, it didn't work. Shit, 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 shit. Actually, it would help in this fight. Limit break. Ah, oh, no effect. It's there, though. The interrupt is there, ladies and gentlemen. The interrupt is there. Praying you get a skirt with insane stats. Mods. GG. Goo goo. I need it all. I'm going to be making alts. Trust me. <laughs> oh, God. Shout out to everyone in chat who's playing with me. I appreciate it. All right. What did we get? We got goggles. All right. There should be a little button up here instead of in your settings, but that's fine. Um, what is it? Character config. Uh, own. How do I do this again? <laughs> uh, brilliant. There's a button. Oh, there is a button there. Oh. Great comms. Great comms. Uh, we're not going to wear those. They look ridiculous. Yeah, <laughs> I saw you, surprise. I was going to run, then I was like, wait. Where's, <laughs> where are they running? 
That was a really fun... That was my favorite dungeon so far. The boss has actually had fun mechanics. Um, okay. Oh, yes. Good comms, Robin. Great comms. I really want to see my limit break. I want to limit break all over the place. What's this? Oh, nice. Um... Anything else you guys recommend? I think we're cool. They reworked the lower level dungeons at some point. Is it just me, or did they add more voice acting as well for the base game? Or am I am I wrong there? Ooh. Oh. Chat. Chat, you guys are forgetting to tell me. Go do your guild quest. Voice acting greatly improves in Heaven's Ward. That's so good to hear. Uh, okay. Report to Mamodi. All right. <coughs> Nanny. Oh, I guess he doesn't give a crap. Shut your mouth, you thieving little swine. You stole from me. Don't even think to deny it. Oh. Please, sir, I didn't steal nothing. I bought this, paid for it with my own coin. What rot, you refugees are all the same. Couldn't afford maggoty mole meat, much less a choice cut of dodo. <laughs> dodo? I'm going to say it one more time. Give back what you stole or I'll make you wish you'd never set foot in this town. Where the hell is he looking? All right, so I should turn you over to the brass blade, you know. Help keep the streets safe for law-abiding citizens. <laughs> I feel like I voice acted him perfectly, by the way. But I ain't done nothing wrong. Twelve is me witness. Look at it. Look at all these cowards. Oh, God. Of course she saw me. The Chad. Please, adventurer, help me. You're a giga Chad. I swear on me mum's grave, I didn't steal nothing. And who the hells are you? When you're at home, this, what? This dog's master. I've had enough of this mama's face. You lot, teach him a lesson. Mate, your barber taught you a lesson. Never to return to him. Oh, that was that is really dark. I didn't even catch on to that. that she, he was suggesting that. Damn, this guy's strong. It's kiting time. <laughs> round and round we go. <laughs> the music's perfect. Oh, I'm getting dizzy. Oh, I actually, I actually, what's it called would actually help in this fight. 
I, I need to put it back in the bar. I, I, the chain one. I need to bring the chain one back. Get wrecked. You'd be a great voice actor. Very kind of you. I've actually heard that quite a bit. I ain't getting paid enough for this. All right, they're out of here. Bless her. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. Where there were more refugees than when I last looked. Five years since the calamity, why don't you come in here now? It's simple. While a number of uh, survived the immediate aftermath of the calamity, many were no longer able to support their communities. Makes sense. Also, ban their homes, seek a new life. Lammy affected the whole room, didn't it? Is the same thing happening in the other cities? If the talk is true, yes. But perhaps our situation is more pronounced. Aldar has a reputation for being prosperous, so it's natural that the refugees would try their luck here first. The Aldar dream, huh? My heart goes out to them. But their presence doesn't foment lawlessness in the city. Well... Things do take a turn for the worse. We always have the immortal flames. That's so cool that stuff like this happens. Uh, the heroes who fought the Garlic Empire patrolled the streets for Rifra. It may well come to that. Like, uh, there's actually, you know, proper repercussions for what happened in the world regarding the Calamity. If you've no coin, you've no hope. Or become of our city. Not all refugees are bad, mind you. Some are able to find employment and lead honest lives. To dodo tenderloins. Get your dodo tenderloins. Guaranteed cheapest in Tanland. Look, there she is buying them. Thank you, ma'am. Looking around, you'd think that old doll was well on its way to recovery. Here we prosperity, and you'll see no end to the misery and suffering. We call that world building. Sir, are you alright? Dodo Tenderloin does sound good. Who does my guy look like? What now? You mean to threaten a defenseless citizen? So I buy that meat, you say? That's absurd. I asked to die. Leave the poor woman alone, you vulture. Who said that? I'll overlook this, but just this once. God bless you. If you hadn't come along when you did, who knows what that monster might have done. It don't bear thinking about. Are you going to pay me? Where's the dodo meat? Case closed. Ada! I've been keeping a close eye on you ever since you left Gridania, and I've been keeping a close eye on those shorts, I'll be honest. Uh, you discharged your duty as envoy impeccably and never once faltered in the face of myriad dangers. 
But more importantly, you're always ready to help those in need. You're possessed of all the qualities we seek in an adventurer. This we are convinced. Right. Okay. Um, and there is the matter of your gift. I dare say you are curious as to the nature of the vision you bore witness a moment ago. We can help you understand it. You're the only one with that power, you know. We have a friend who has it too and would love for you to meet her. I'd love to meet her too. And meeting her is only the beginning. But we would have you marry her. And lend your strength. Okay, they didn't say the marriage part. Um, in return, we will be glad to assist your adventuring endeavors. Come join the Avengers. It's time. Look at that great camera angle, man. Good work. They know exactly what they were doing putting him with her. They know exactly what they were doing. Wait a minute. We haven't even told you the name of our order. We are the Scions of the Seventh Dawn. Defenders of Justice. Oh, but don't tell anyone except for Mamodi. She knows already. Because Mamodi's the best girl. Justice and honor. Well, me and Water Malone will uh, roll on by. <laughs> okay. okay. Um, all right. Guy Griffin? Wait a minute. Guy Griffin? Who the hell's this? Who the hell made Guy Griffin? That was my WoW character who died to a fish. Who are you? Oh, my melon. First of all, you're freaking badass. You're a Lala fell with a. Uh, Nah, the melon's nearly bigger than you. A pompadour. So, the law here is... Guy, <laughs> Guy Griffin's my WoW character who died to a fish. I am the fish killer. Alright, do a... Do a... Do an emote. There you go. Yeah, do... Do something funny, Lalafell. Hurry up. Be cute and adorable. There we go. <laughs> oh yeah, I didn't notice the evil- You broke my melon! You evil little bastard, I've got my eyes on you. I didn't notice the mustache. Every character has a mustache like that's evil. Hmm, you broke my melon again. Who is this chat? Bro, you're gonna need a, you're gonna need a smaller shield. Die, melon. Okay. Have you noticed Lala Fells walk like fat people? It's like they they walk like they're ten times fatter than they are. Give us the Lala Fell walk. <laughs> no, they walk like they can't bend their kneecaps. Wait, do they not have knees? Am I being ableist? Oh, man. Oh, they're adorable. All right, all right. I don't know who you are, but I'm adding you. Jeez, he's fast. What class are you? Oh, my God, you're a tank. You're actually a tank. Of course you're a tank. See, this is why I love MMOs. No, I didn't mean to invite you to the party. You're not that special. I need to send you a friend request. You, you, missed, you missed all the... What's it called? You missed all of them. Am I still taller than you when I sit? Uh, no, not really. Yeah, I am actually, yeah. Even with the pompadour buff. <clears throat> I'm not that special. Well, no, no, you are special. You're Guy Griffin, for God's sakes. Well, you have a lovely day. And, uh, I'm sorry the me our meeting was so short. Uh, uh, I mean, I'm sorry our... I didn't have a tall tale to tell. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, I'm so awkward. I'm just bad at goodbyes, chat.
That is a great name. Robin Graves. Wait a minute. <laughs> That's a great name. <laughs> Mamodi and her gossip. You should see a Lala fell pallid in tank, the heaviest hit from the biggest boss. It's absolutely glorious. <laughs> uh, it's good to see you safe and well. Look at you, no one would ever guess you'd been hard out with giants in the dark. Well, that sounds wrong, Mamodi. <laughs> Amaro, the station master, she'll be overjoyed when she hears the no news. A Salasu wants a word of you. Didn't actually know your name, but hearing her description, I know who meant right away oh it's ed thank you for sparing the time i realize you don't know me but i've been longing to speak with you right aren't you that failure of a healer my name is ed i'm an adventurer like you and i'm not very good at being one truth be told anyway i was adventuring with my friends in gradania when when the leader of our party was killed his name was avir and he and i were to be wedged you may not remember him, but to say that he remembered you would be an understatement. He would sing your praises from dawn to dusk. He saw you from what you are. You see, an adventurer's adventure. Rah. And so... Did I ever meet a veer chat? Is that the big green guy? The paladin boss guy? I believe that he would have ex had a fiend not robbed him of the chance since that they have fought long and hard about giving up adventure. When I think of the man you are and all that you've achieved, I find that I inspired. So I decide to start again as an adventure. I'll go back to the village of my birth and begin my training anew. Oh, you're going to make an ult? How about not be a healer this time, love? I wanted to meet you first to ask you your name. My name's Jeff. Mario RPG Gaming. <laughs> I really shouldn't have named my character that. Uh, well, thank you, Mario RPG Gaming. I shall like and subscribe. Very well. Be a cruel bleeding business. Um, thought it'd be a right pain in the ass. <laughs> but against my better judgment, I decided to accept the post, and I'm fully glad I did. I feel privileged to be a part of your lives, and that goes for you too. Uh, what did you say? You want to know about the signs of the seventh? Sorry, <clears throat> you want to know about the signs of the seventh dawn? They're beginning to move in earnest then. Listen to Mario, the Scions ain't no ordinary folk, and the work they do ain't no ordinary work. I know for well how capable you are, but even you wouldn't think twice about attempting some of the stuff they do. <clears throat> Alright. I just want everyone to know that in three and a half hours, I've done two main story levels. That's slow. The Scions of the Seventh Dawn. There she is. No, no, no. I don't like cactus. I don't like cactus. I don't like cactus. Uh, you can trust the Scions. They're good people. Oh, that is a badass piece. What the hell, bro? Oh, never mind. Individuals like you. No, I'm going to leave you told you, but you must promise to keep this information to yourself. Headquartered in Vesper Bay out in Western Fanalan. Off you go. All right, go to the Waking Sands in Vesper Bay. Oh, we're probably only ever going to go there once, but I mean, I guess I'll go there. Did I? Did you kill her fiance already? No, I haven't killed nobody's fiance. Yes. What the hell, bro? I love how in Final Fantasy, no one wants to look badass. They all just want to look fabulous. Fabulous. Sorry. Be wary what you say of Waifu Ishtola. 
Jeez, all right, all right. Calm down, guys. Calm down. If she had bunny ears, she'd be ten times better. Oh, there's a green. There's a green. There's green people in this game running. That sounds a bit racist. <laughs> Nah, I don't think I don't think I'm into Ishtola. The only way I'd really be into her is if she had a really hot English British accent, but surely that's not the case, right? They're probably gonna give her a, you know, super anime accent or something like that. But if she sounds like, you know, like a a thirty five year old hot librarian, do you know what I mean? Then then maybe, but I don't think that's gonna be the case. So I think we should be alright. Um, anyway, I'm going the wrong way. What was this? Thank you, Ronan. Do, 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 do. You guys let me know if I go near any of those blue quests, I really should do. Oh, that's the housing, that's housing. No one cares about housing. I'm joking, everyone cares about housing but me. Edda's story continues in Gradania somewhere. Well, she she sounds like an older woman. You'll 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 hear him afterwards. Uh, I I would actually like to do Edda's story. So let me know where that is, and uh, maybe I'll go pick that up. If there's any like super like. Uh, cool um, side quests that you guys really recommend I do, then by all means, let me know. Oh yeah, we definitely want to get Glamours. 100%. Hmm. Oh, uh, this bloody run. I'm gonna get used to this when we run out of those letters they give us. Do I have a setting where background music's turning off on its own or something? Ooh, ooh. Another one somewhere. There we go. Strong. I should really leave uh, my hunting log for alts. I think, right? Oh, is this a glamour person? Oh yeah, each class, yeah. Is this a glamour person? I know this person's important. Yes, it is. What about, uh... Yeah, might as well.
the, the most important quests. Let's be honest, that's the main story right there. How you doing, Tysa? Delicious! Wow, that animation took long. Now, these glamour crystals... Do you ever run out of them? Are they like super expensive to get? Do I have do I have to buy an orange juice? But I actually need food. Um what's a good Ooh, that's an orange juice. Uh, what's a good food that's cheap? Is orange juice good? XP bonus free. Do I really want XP bonus? I kind of... No, I kind of don't. Because the more I think about it... I don't want to over... Super over level my... Uh, what's it called? I know it's only 3%, but... All right. Yeah, I'll already over level. Okay. Um, besides the house, you went for the quest. Robin Graves. So. <laughs> Deep in the desert of my heart, a lonely flower blooms, yearning for the heavens above. Went my first for you. Tra la 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 la. Ah. <clears throat> I would thank you not to sneak up on me like that. I mean, your peripheral vision is probably really bad with those days. Uh, now, please be advised, this is private property. Unless you have pertinent business here, I must ask you to... Yeah, I'm a Chad. Um, here at the behest of Ida and Papi Limo. And please have your name. The Mario RPG Gaming. Ah, here you are. Headquarters of the science, okay. So, are you just a secretary? Can I talk to the important people? Okay, that was adorable. Alright, the sentence is within the soul. I shall let her know to expect you. Oh, thank you. See, look at these, look at these legends. Four already. Hmm. Guy Griffin doesn't have a level. Interesting. Very interesting. All right. In we go. Lady Minfilia has eagerly awaited your coming. Uh, how did she know? Uh, these are all awful. There she is. So you are the adventurer of whom I've heard so much. Well met, friend. 
My name is Minfilia, and I lead the Scions of the Seventh Dawn. I have awaited your coming. How did you know? Look at this group of misfits. Please, be at ease. You are among friends here. Mm, not sure about one of them. <laughs> no doubt you are ripe to burst with questions. But have patience. All will be revealed in time. That face. First, let me begin by telling you who we are and what we do. We are the Scions of the Seventh Dawn, an order that transcends political boundaries. Our single objective is the preservation of the future of Eorzea. Among our gravest concerns are the godlike beings known as the Primals. Their existence is a bane upon Eorzea, nay, the world at large, and we have striven to find a lasting solution to the threat they pose. Our order is home to a number of individuals who, like you, possess a rare and special talent. This talent takes various forms, but one holds particular interest for us. I wonder what one it is. My Tell fighting you, ability. Have you ever oh. experienced a sudden, inexplicable loss of consciousness? I am when I'm around you. Have you, you ever had the sensation of being pulled away from reality? Felt as though you were hovering in space? A mind without a body? All these things are the manifestations of your talent. Yours is the power to transcend the boundaries of the soul. A power known as the Echo. The Echo. The Echo allows the you echo. to pass through the walls of a man's soul and hear the resonations of his past. <laughs> yeah, right. You will be there in his memories and see things as he saw them. You may even interact with that which you see, though you cannot change the outcome of events. It's actually a really cool power. For another blessing, the Echo will enable echo. you to know a man's mind even if you cannot comprehend his words. In short, the Echo is a the truly echo. extraordinary power. And this power is strong within but we, you. you. It seems we can't it use it on a command. It is that we cannot use it whensoever we choose. Let's see. That's right. I, too, possess the Echo. The Echo. With that established, let us return to the subject of the Primals. So long as they exist, the realm cannot take so much as a single step towards true peace. Measures must be taken. Measures which transcend boundaries, be they of faction, Wait, race, what are we measuring? or creed. <laughs> and to do so, the Scions require the aid of those with our talent. Make no mistake, the Echo will be the instrumental echo. in dealing with the primal threat. Without it, we cannot hope to save the realm. I know not what it is you desire for yourself, nor what it was that first brought you to Eorzea. But I firmly believe that the power we possess was given to us for a purpose. Why else would the gods entrust man with a gift so extraordinary, if not to have him use it? Are and we still so talking? I implore you, okay. lend us your power. Great speech. Ah. Uh, okay, we have, fortunately I have the number of influential allies, and a word from me that will gladly afford you certain privileges that might otherwise be denied. Uh, you can employ retainers, for example. They are individuals who may be relied upon to manage your assets and belongings on your behalf. I never understood this retainer stuff. The papers you requested, milady. I haven't watched One Piece. <laughs> I don't know why that relates to One Piece, but you guys are everywhere, so. Pleasure is mine, milady. 
By way of a welcome gift, I take the liberty of adding your name to the retainer's registry, as if now you're entitled to employ the services of a retainer. But my teeth are great! You need to consult a retainer, okay, regarding a particular arrangement. Believe me when I say that retainers will prove invaluable. Retainers this game version of the personal bank. We will serve the greater good. A turkey field troop on earth. Uh, forgive me, it's important all concerned or aware of what's expected. Now you know our purpose, now we can offer you. I invite you to consider joining us. Uh, now I'm alright. <laughs> he just walks out. <laughs> and then end credits. In good faith, I can trust you with our order's password. It is Wild Rose. Pray keep it safe. I mean, you can literally just leave and become a fisher. True. Help for NPCs who could be hired players to carry out such tasks as storing excess gill. Sell unwanted items. Interesting. I take it you will help us. No, I want to be a fisherman. Wonderful. I knew you wouldn't let us down. How can I say no to such a pretty face? But come, I would introduce you to your friends in the order. Tell me, does the name Charlianne ring any bells? No. It used to be one of Eorzea's six city states and was situated in the northwest of Aldenard. The Charlians were the keepers of wisdom both old and new. Their mastery over magic and ether was unsurpassed, and even the Garlians knew to fear them. Among their number, there were a noble few who devoted their lives to safeguarding the future of Eorzea. When the realm began its descent into chaos, chaos! and their countrymen fled for the motherland, they alone chose to remain here. These noble men and women were called the Archons. Those same brave souls stand before you now. The masked woman is Ida, and beside her is Popolimo. The two are charged with surveying the Twelveswood. Hello there! <laughs> Welcome! Oh god, she sounds like something out of Oliver Twist. I had every confidence that you would agree to help us. Me too. Mary Poppins? <gasps> okay, my turn to introduce someone. That there is Thancred. He is our man here in Ulda, Jewel of the Desert. Good one. Welcome to the team. Oh, okay, this guy's for the ladies. If I may, the lovely maiden beside me is named Yastola. Limsa Lominsa has the pleasure of being under her care. Greetings. A lady? Last but not least is Orianger, who presides over all affairs within these halls. Pray seek him out whenever you have questions. Dawn may banish even the darkest night. Bit creepy. The words <laughs> of a dear friend. I am glad of our meeting. Okay. Uh. At the Battle of Cartineau, our leader was taken from us. But we did not stray from our purpose. Told you. 35 year old Minfilla librarian. And others with her talent. And together establish the scions of the seventh dawn. Along with the Archons, those blessed with the Echo play a pivotal role in our endeavor to forge a brighter tomorrow for the realm. Oh, I should also.
also introduce you to Tataru, our clerk. Tataru? Everything runs smoothly. Pleased to make your acquaintance. <laughs> In time, I hope you will come Wait. to think of us as family. But without further ado, I don't think that I don't think it's that bad. The voice I would acting. assign you your first task. I actually don't think it's that bad. I've heard much Very worse. Angé. Have the documents arrived? Minfilia's from the is good. From it's I funny that Tartaru is just randomly American. Recently. We have received a request for aid from the Immortal Flames. Thancred, would you do the honors? It would be my pleasure. Some days ago, a crystal caravan registered to Amagina and Sons Mineral Concern was waylaid and divested of its cargo. But there is more. Within a bell of the robbery, several people were reported missing from the shanty town outside the city. At a glance, one would assume the involvement of bandits, kidnappers, and coincidence. Such crimes are hardly uncommon, and the immortal flames deal with their like almost every day. However, this time we have reason to believe that a primal is involved. Dun dun. Aye, the evidence left behind implicates the Amosia, who are known worshippers of Ifrit. If worshippers? we consider the objects that were taken, there is no room left for doubt. The crimes were committed in the name of a primal. Ifrit's the coolest primal, by the way. That you may better understand the nature of our struggle with the primals, I would have you play the leading rock. role in this investigation. You have my thanks. If there is aught you wish to know, I recommend you speak with Thancred. He is well versed in the affairs of Ulda. Ever at your service, dear fellow. All right. And that, ladies and gentlemen, are the Avengers. The Avengers of Final Fantasy. Investigate a crystal robbery in a spate of abductions. So we've got to go talk to the people. Who, uh, their caravan got attacked. Let's go get some advice. Uh, some information. So, few things. I should put this. I, I think it's about time we made a... Uh... Mm. No, I think we're good for now. I think we're good. It's not getting too packed. So why would I? When I need, when you guys say I need, I need to get one of those retainers as a bank. Is that like to, you know, make them store crafting stuff and stuff like that? Camp Drybone. Man, we really need to explore Fanalan. Uh, uh, I didn't want to do that. So we're going to go here and then work our way across. I think that's the play. Oh, for God's sakes! If you want to sell something in the auction, you need a retainer. Okay. I probably won't be doing auction selling, right? Maybe? I don't know if I get something insanely rare that you guys think I should get. But, I think... We can call that there. Um, short stream today. Short stream today. 